Okay guys, welcome back to another video here today at Bowditch Point, Fort Myers Beach. It's about 4.30 p.m. Um, outgoing tide, tide's about halfway out. We're gonna be getting after some beach fish today, but off the back side of the island. So we're gonna set up the beach cart on the back side because of the rough conditions. As you can see out there, you have wind surfers and everything else out there just really rough conditions still from the, all the storms and uh it's gonna settle down here in the next few days but for right now we're gonna get out there winnie can't wait to get out there take the dog out with the new beach cart got the new beach cart here as you guys can see real nice got the big beach wheels with bearings ultra smooth over the sand got the new beach bag the new umbrella the new chairs all the new rods and reels daiwa bgs and uh we're gonna have some fun guys let's get after it stay tuned we'll see you out there thanks for watching winnie <laughs> hey come here winnie hey you can't get lost Yes, sir. Oh my God, I was just telling him about your YouTube. <laughs> funny. <laughs> I was like, this guy catches good. <laughs> That's funny. How you doing, buddy? A little quincy. That's good. Thanks. All right, we're going to catch some bait here with the cast net, guys. I don't have anybody to hold the camera for me. I'm not going to wear it on my chest while I cast the net. I don't want to lose any more money. I've spent enough. I've wasted enough. Well, it's not a waste because I enjoy, I love doing this, so, so you're definitely not wasting money. Do what uh, you love, do what makes you happy. This is the best possible thing I could be doing right now. I can't think of anything better. Please don't catch any snook. Please don't catch any snook. I got plenty of bait. Plenty of bait. Just what I wanted in my first cast. Beautiful. I don't want to throw the net too much here because I'm going to be fishing here. If I can get as much bait as I can in one or two casts. Look at that. All finger mullet. All finger mullet. Which, finger mullet's not my favorite. I prefer white bait, honestly. I prefer Mahara's over anything. Like, here's a small Mahara, but it's too small. So, big Mahara's are what you want. Or those small finger mullet. Okay, finger mullet going out. Right through the nasal cavity. Keep them as lifelike as possible. Looking as realistic as possible. Put him right over there. It drops off pretty deep right there. So we'll keep him right there. And there you have it guys. There's the setup right there. We got the two small 3000s on the uh, spikes. We got the 4000 on the cart and the 5000. They all have different size bait. That's the new beach cart with the new sand wheels. Finally upgraded on that. Got everything the way I want it. Got the new chairs, the new umbrella, all the little accessories that come with it. The new beach setup. Well, no bites. No bites on the live bait. It's been about 30 minutes of nothing. So let's throw the lure around a little bit.
there's a little snuck. Oh, popped out. Baby. Just a baby. Yeah. Oh, she's on. She's on. We got something on the... Uh, she's reeling it in awfully quick. I don't know. You on? You on? Tighten the drag. Righty tighty. Oh, she's on. I guess. You got it? Are you stuck on bottom? No, it's pulling. Is it? Hold it still for a minute. Let me see. Way up. Okay. Wow. It's a big one. Here. Tighten the drag a little. Oh, I'm going to let you pull this in. This is a big fish. Just don't let him go around the piling. Let's walk him this way. Keep, keep tension on the line. Oh, this is a big fish. This, he's staying down. He's staying down. Tired. He's going towards that piling. Okay. That feels like a ray. It's sticking to the bottom. Here, hold this. Oh, he's going to get stuck around the other lines. Oh. Here, take the uh, camera. Just hold it like this for me. Going around all the lines. Camera's gonna die. Yeah, he's sticking. He's sticking to the bottom. This is a big ray. I hate to even try to get this thing in on this little stuff. I'd rather cut him off. I'm sure he's got me wrapped up around the other lines now. That's for sure. Just gotta pull him in without snapping his rod. Oh man, it's going to take me forever to pull this in. Oh, oh, he's coming in. He turned his head. Ah, it's going across all my lines.
we're gonna have a big rat's nest. This was on the uh, mullet. This was on a little live mullet, finger mullet. Could be a little, could be a nurse shark. Something that sticks to the bottom. Oh, he's coming this way now. Yeah, he does have that line right there. He has my big rod line. Yep. I see it. Is there any way you can grab that other line for me? Uh, a big mess. Get the cruise ship back there too. Big fish on such a little rod. It's a big fish. Could be a nurse shark. <sighs> but I say it's a ray. Of the truth be told, it's a big ray. It's a big ray. Mm. Ah, these things do not give up. Actually, I'm underneath my line right there. Yeah, I got away from my other line. We don't have a big. Oh. This is the biggest ray I've gotten on such small tackle. He's sticking, boy. He's sticking to that bottom. He's smart. It's a giant ray. Look at the size of this thing. I can't believe I pulled this in on this little tiny rod. Is it still going? Well, both of us, yeah. Ah, there he goes. Snapped it. Big giant ray. He was massive. He was massive. He was probably about, probably like that. Probably like this thick. Massive for such a tiny little rod. But he didn't snap the rod, thank God. He just snapped the line. He'll come 